Well, New Orleans bars are officially shut down. Live look on Bourbon Street right now. You see the NOPD vehicles and officers that are standing out there making sure people stay off the streets. All of this comes from the city's restrictions to limit the spread of COVID-19, closing popular streets and bars across the city this Mardi Gras weekend. Devin Bartolotta has been out there throughout the evening, including whenever all those streets were shut down. It is hard to believe this is what Bourbon Street looks like on the Friday of Mardi Gras weekend. Much quieter, no crowds, and all by the mayor's order. Barricades are up on Bourbon Street, keeping crowds and cars away. The kickoff to Mardi Gras weekend, unlike any we're used to. Um, Mardi the Mardi Gras, Gras that's not happening. <laughs> but it's okay, because we out here, we turned up. To get into the French Quarter this weekend, you'll need a reason or a destination. And once you're there, there are no go cups, no package liquor sales, and no bars. We knew 24 hours ago, but we still decided to come just to kind of give the spirit of Mardi Gras. The restrictions caused some would-be tourists to cancel trips. Some came anyway. Others had no idea the rules had changed. I mean, we found out about the restrictions, but, you know, we had already we had already made our plans to come down to New Orleans and, you know, well, uh, restrictions weren't going to stop us. Uh, Not really, no. no. We knew there was stuff, but we, we thought Mardi Gras would have a little bit of, of fun, but we didn't know it was going to be this bad. But. Matt Reasoner brought his kids in from Atlanta and didn't even know it was Mardi Gras weekend. Uh, I, I, I didn't even realize any of it. We just came to, you know, basically we came to eat. As we head into a would-be busy weekend, Airbnb says it is enforcing its no-party policy, and NOPD boasted there's no tolerance for crowds. Everyone has a stake in this COVID-19 response. New Orleans will have to find a way to celebrate safely. Let's let's be honest. It's it, you know the the COVID thing is definitely serious. People need to take that in consideration, but you also want to have a little bit of fun. The restrictions currently in place expire after Mardi Gras. On Bourbon Street, Devin Bartolotta, Eyewitness News.